Welcome or welcome back to Guitar Lele Tutorials. Today we are going to learn how to play songs on guitar or ukulele. Maybe you are at a campfire or in a party and you saw a guitar or ukulele there. Yes, you heard it right, a guitar or ukulele there. Someone says, hey man, you play this instrument right? Let's listen something from you. And you say, no, 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 I don't play guitar or ukulele. And the conversation is followed by an awkward silence. No, don't be that guy. Guitar lele may not be common, but guitar with a capo and ukulele of course are. You know what another thing is common? They are tuning. No, I don't mean guitar match exactly with guitar lele in tuning. But if you place a capo on fifth fret of the standard tuning guitar, you'll get a standard tuning ukulele. The fret lengths won't be too different from guitar lele after fifth fret on a guitar. Ukulele strings on the other hand are just the fourth thinnest string of the guitar lele. The G string on ukulele most probably be an octave higher, but who cares? Strumming can be done seamlessly on that too. The size of ukulele matters but not too much. Guitar lele is pretty much the same size of tenor ukulele. Concert and soprano are smaller. Some adjustment needs attention for the fret length difference. I have a soprano ukulele and a guitar lele. I can pretty much say if you have experience with guitar lele, the fretboard length won't pose much of a challenge if you dedicate 5 to 10 minutes of practice with new instruments on spot. If you think you can play guitar or ukulele straight away after the beginner course, the straightforward answer is no, you can't. These are all different instruments and needs to be paid proper respect in terms of practice. But yes, in situations like this, these methods can be pretty decent and nice solutions. In fact, I did it once. I went to my uncle's home and my cousin has a guitar. He asked me if I can play guitar. I told him, I don't play guitar but ukulele. These were days before I started with guitar lele. I told him, let me try. I took his capo and put it on 5th fret and started playing some songs. It was difficult to not hit the thickest two strings and handle picks at that time but I managed after few minutes of practice. Being a guitar lele player filled that two strings gap too. So if anyone asks me to play anything on guitar going forward, I'll confidently play some songs from memory. Pretty much you have your instrument in either case. Next thing you need are chords. That's what you have to memorize. Choose some of the songs from your songbook with repetitive chord progression. Choose the ones you like the most and enjoy playing and can be easily remembered. For example, I memorized Purano Shai Diner Katha by Arun Tegar on ukulele and I still remember the progression. There are some more that I have with me all the time no matter what. So, even if I don't have my songbook with me and someone hands me a guitar, guitar lele or ukulele, I can play at least 5 to 6 songs. Maybe 4 or 5 songs you can keep in your mind too and don't need to carry your songbook everywhere. Try with the easy ones for now and in future we are going to memorize complex songs too. Now if you can sing too, that's great, but if you don't, Usually, you will meet someone there who will do the singing part or maybe a chorus with all the participants there. A good jamming session will be followed for sure. So, don't lose the opportunity. Memorize some songs and when opportunity comes, show your talent to the world. 